Hello everyone and welcome back to acting. This week what we are going to do is continue our work with sense memories. But what we're going to do is I want you, I'm going to give you some scenarios and I want you to think about them, visualize them, and see if a memory or response can come with them. All right? So, this, one of the, the most famous stories is from Lee Strasberg's method acting, right? What he did is he had an actress put out her hand and imagine that there was a candle with a flame that was heating up and burning the, un, the, the, the palm of her hand. And the more she visualized it, the more she could feel the tingling until finally she went, ah, and it hurt her. See, your mind and your body, they're pretty cool and really connected in so many ways that if you think it and that image becomes clear enough, you'll feel something physical. Your body will do stuff. So, what I want you to do first is I want you to close your eyes, visualize yourself picking up dog poop. Imagine the feel of it in your hand. Okay, let it go, and I want you to work with that until you can visualize it. Now, I want you to imagine stepping foot into Disneyland. As soon as you walk through the gates, and you hear the sounds, and you smell the smells of Disneyland, what are those? Can you find them in your memory banks? What is that? And spend time visualizing it to see if you can get there. The next is I want you to imagine petting your favorite pet. What, do they, what does the, the pet feel like? What textures do you feel? What is the feeling that you have inside when you pet that dog? That cat, that fish, that lizard, that snake, whatever pet that is. Okay, now shake it off. Now I want you to imagine you're about to have a very difficult conversation with somebody. Maybe it's a breakup. Maybe you have to fire someone. Maybe you have to tell them you've lost or broken something. And then that is the difficult situation. I want you to go back and revisit that memory and see if that memory can have a, an effect on you. And maybe you have something around that can help trigger that response for you. Maybe it's connected with something. Try to find that, try to visualize it, see how that feels. Now I want you to imagine that you're sitting next to somebody you think is attractive. Okay, so what is that? How does that make you feel? I want you to visualize who it is, what that person smells like. If you've ever touched their skin, right? Sometimes your, your hand or your arm will touch their arm or their hand. Your, your skin is hyper aware of what their skin is like. You're hyper aware of everything that they do, every move, even the energy that they're creating. I want you to go through each of those scenarios and I want you to make them as real as possible for yourself. And then what I want you to do is once you've had an, a response, once you've actually created that memory, then I want you to upload your experience. What was that like? What memories worked for you, which ones didn't? And were there any others that you think are better that I can add to the class next time? All right, everyone. I can't wait to see how your experience was with this, what you learn and unlock about yourself. And maybe, I'm hoping, you can teach me stuff about myself. All right, everyone. I can't wait to see your responses. And I'll see you soon.